guys, it's me, Astro from Astrophobia, and in today's Get Ready With Me, I am going to be cosplaying Kana from Miss Kabayashi's Dragon Maid, and I've, again, same with my Your Forger cosplay, I've only ever done her cosplay once, and it's literally one of my favourites, I love it so much, uh, a lot of people have been, like, mentioning the fluffy wig and stuff, and the funny thing is, don't give me any credit for the fluffy wig, I got it second hand, uh, and the wig just came, like, really fluffy, when I had it, I was like, let's go, because I don't have wig crimpers, um, and also you may have seen me mention I'm getting a Mitsuri cosplay, I'm also getting that secondhand, and the wig is also going to be crimped, so if you like crimped wigs then <laughs> look forward to my Mitsuri cosplay coming in like a few years or something because I'm getting it from two different places. Anyway, back to what I was saying, I'm going to be cosplaying Kana. Um, Miss Kabayashi's Dragon Maid isn't even that popular anymore, I know it was very popular back when like uh, season 2 came out, but I don't see like anyone talking about it anymore, which is so sad because I really love it I don't care that there's no plot. The characters are cute. Okay, um, if you're this far into the video and haven't left yet Then comment who your favorite character from Miss Kabayashi's Dragon Maid is and if you haven't seen it Go watch it. You can watch it in the background while you do stuff. Anyway in this video I'm gonna start by <clears throat> Sorry, I'm gonna start by putting on the outfit just kind of explaining it to you guys doing my makeup Explaining that to you guys. Oh my rabbits in here. If you watched my last get ready with me video You know what he looks like then I'm gonna do put on the wig put the accessories on the wig and finish the outfit Um, my rabbit's gone back in his corner again. Anyway, I will see you guys when I have the outfit on and I'll kind of explain it to you uh, Show all the different parts and stuff and then I'll go and do my makeup after that Okay guys, <clears throat> sorry I think I have a call or something. Um, here is the outfit on. I know it looks a bit weird right now, first of all, because I'm not wearing the wig. And second of all, because the petticoat uh, under the skirt. The skirt, well, I'm glad it came with a petticoat, but they don't fit together great, um, just because of the way the skirt was made. Um, I mean, the cosplay is still high enough quality. If you look here, this has got actual fur on it. Um, it's got the buttons on here. Unfortunately, it doesn't come with like the black thing in between these but i feel like it would be difficult to lace up anyway so i'm not super mad about that the rest of the costume is pretty accurate um i don't care it's not the highest quality you can't tell on camera and it looks cute enough for me um this has got a little like clasp thing on it which is the same thing at the back of my your forger dress and i'm really suck at doing them up um so it took me like five minutes just to get that done up i the cosplay didn't come with socks i do have socks on as you can see here um but yeah I'm it, the cosplay looks better when I'm standing up of course because I'm sitting down and the petticoat sits with I am pretty happy about like um the deal I got for this cosplay because since it was second hand on Vinted I'd been looking for a can of cosplay for like so long and all of them were like 35 pound for just the outfit not even the wig and this one was 20 pound for outfit and wig and it looked like it would be a size too big for me but I'm kind of glad that I sized up anyway on it because if I'd gotten it any smaller I probably would have just had to return it because it would have been like too small like because of like the skirt and the top and um, it's supposed to be like loose and stuff because like Kana's like I know she's not actually a child, but like physically she looks like a child. So, you know, anyway, I'm gonna do my makeup and then I will report back and tell you guys how it looks. Okay guys, I'm back and I have done my makeup. As you can see, I did kind of mess up on the eyeliner a bit, but I'm getting better at applying my eyelashes. Obviously you can't see it on this cause I'm filming this on a computer. Uh, so you can't see the quality very well. Um, the lighting has just got considerably worse for some reason. It is, there we go. It is a very sunny day today in the UK, which is surprising. Oh, I forgot to put lipstick on. I'll do that in a minute when I reveal the final cosplay. Anyway, it's a very sunny day today, which is surprising because I'm in the UK um, and we like never get sunny weather. It's not even that hot at all but compared to usually it feels boiling so i'm probably gonna go outside my dad was trying to coax my rabbit joey out of the corner of the room but he's still sleeping there he's not even been awoken at all by me wearing a strange outfit um anyway i am pretty happy with my makeup compared to usual i tried to like exaggerate it a bit because like candles like a child she's got like big eyes and stuff um she does have blue eyes i don't have dark blue contacts so i can't wear them but i'm pretty happy with the cosplay so far i'm gonna put the wig on the wig will probably make or break it because i know a lot of people like the fluffy bangs but i'm really bad at like maintaining wigs and stuff so the like the styling may have like 
ruined itself. Anyway, I'm gonna go put the wig on, the accessories, and also do my lipstick because it looks more red. Like, the makeup looks like I've got pink on my eyes in real life, but you cannot tell on camera. Um, also, my makeup, like, I, the contour isn't that heavy. It's the lighting on the camera, like, changes the way I look a lot. As I said, I'll put a picture or a video at the end of how the cosplay actually looks in real life because I take it through my phone. Like, all my other videos are taken through my iPhone. This is a computer. Anyway, moving on. I'll do the accessories, fix my lips, and put the wig on, and I'll show you guys the final cosplay. Okay, guys, here is the final cosplay. I am very, very happy with it. Um, I added some new things to the wig, if I can get this to sit right. Uh, I buy a lot of accessories for wigs, like, um, in charity shops, so I'm just going to quickly go over everything in this cosplay and where I got it from. So the main outfit and the wig... Um, coming came with the horns and the beads in the hair as well was um from vintage second hand so i can't say where i got it from like exactly where the original person got it from but you can get things similar on like aliexpress or any other site where you get cosplays from probably um the stuff in the wig so these bunny clips here um when i went on vacation to bulgaria that's when i got them so i can't really say but again if you search like bunny hair clips on aliexpress then you could probably get them this is just a tiny little glittery hair clip here i have a pack of these in a bunch of different colors for all my wigs they were from just a random shop as well i can't remember this pearl hair clip this bow they're both from a charity shop this little butterfly hair clip griffin let me steal from her house on Thursday so thank you Griffin I just realized whenever I do this I don't know if you guys can hear it but the balls in the hair keep like rubbing against my clothes and making a noise also the hair also looks pretty cute like this but that's not how she has it in the show so I just keep it behind also I have this little necklace on me and Griffin have matching ones um, if, if you don't if you guys don't know who Griffin is then you should because she's probably gonna comment on this video because she comments on all my videos I'll put like here are her comments you can tell what kind of person she is um anyway we do know each other in real life so it's i'm not just like making fun of some random stranger on the internet we do actually know each other because i do bully her it looks like i bully her guys but i promise i don't bully her that much in real life okay just a teensy bit um i do force her to wear wigs sometimes as you can see in my 500 subscriber special anyway enough about griffin she let me steal this hair clip thank you griffin um the gloves were from sheen but i don't recommend getting stuff from sheen because like child labor or whatever i just realized i still have my genshin impact bracelet on to anyone who mentioned this yes it is pyro and it does glow in the dark um i went to a friend's birthday party and they don't even play genshin impact but their mom thought it was an anime so they had a whole genshin impact themed party with genshin like cakes and stuff and we all got free genshin stickers keychains and these bracelets here mine's pyro um it's good because i literally love pyro my other favorite elements though are like hydro and dendro because one i'm a yeoland main and two i love every dendro character i'm gonna be pulling for cave um because i love him he is my fave um if you guys play genshin who is your favorite genshin character and who do you main i know i ask you a lot of questions in this video but on my long videos, no one comments. And I'm like, guys, everyone comments on my shorts videos, but never on my long videos. I promise I don't bite, guys. Please comment on my long videos because it tells me that you like them. Also, if you have any feedback for like my long videos on stuff I could do to make them more interesting or things I could add, then don't, like feel free to tell me. Um, even like constructive criticism. If I say it's welcome, then it's welcome. Like, don't be afraid to comment something um, because I really don't mind and I do take account for everything. Also, I just realized these horns on the headband, they are hot glued. Like when I got the cosplay, I was like, oh, that's strange. They've been hot glued on, which is very surprising because they've stuck very well. Same with the little bow at the top. So mad credit to whoever had this before me and hot glued it together because I don't have a hot glue gun and then I would have to have hot glue together. And that's just a pain. Anyway, um, this is the final cosplay. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video, which, um, depending on when i edit this it will either be my april cosplay compilation or this will come after the april cosplay compilation in which case you guys can vote for which get ready with me i do next because i have a lot to do um and also because my mitsuri cosplay will hopefully be here by the time i get around to filming again anyway guys i will see you in the next video thank you so much for getting to the very end unless you just skip to the end to see the cosplay anyway thank you for watching um liking and subscribing is greatly appreciated bye <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> <laughs>